just like ran right into it and this group of tourists were like, oh no, is she okay? And I'm too tired I, to yeah, even like I think we're just tired. <laughs> just like the 10 hour bus ride really did us in. Uh. What's up, P Nation? Today's our last day in Slovakia before we head to the Ukraine. It is 4.28 in the morning right now, and we are get, about to get on a bus that's gonna take... 10-ish hours. Woo. Yeah. So we're hoping to like, got up really early. It's a really early bus, so we're hoping to sleep yeah. for like five hours, and Hopefully. then like wake up and maybe like watch the movies. I don't know. But first we gotta find where the bus station is. We don't really know, yes. so we have 30 minutes to do that. So we gotta go. <laughs> later we are still at the border this bus is hot and we're sweating <laughs> we didn't have to get off the bus though i thought we we're gonna have to get off the bus yeah. and tow our stuff through so we were just able to sit here you watch the movie i'm on my second movie. movie you're on your second movie yeah so i don't know how long it's gonna take but we'll see no wonder it takes 10 hours and we're finally moving <laughs> i have no idea how much longer we have on us it's really bumpy and it's really hot <laughs>
we left. So, felt like more than 10 hours, but it was 10 hours. Sorry for the wind, but it actually feels better outside than it does in the bus. Like, yeah. we have air conditioning on, but this wind feels amazing right now. And so we're gonna get on a, like an unair conditioned bus, and then I was like, I think everything's a little bit cheaper in Ukraine, and that is definitely the case. We just got an Uber for how much? $3. our Airbnb, walked up the steps, oh wait, I fell up the steps. All of a sudden it got really dark and I was like, what are we doing? And then all of a sudden, I was on the ground and Leo was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? And I was like, I didn't say that, I said, are you okay? Okay, she was really nice afterward, but in the moment, it was the heat No! Anyways. He's lying! I'm not lying! Okay, we're gonna try and go get some food. She found a kebab place, and I'm really looking forward to finding some soft serve ice cream because it's like still 95 so hot. My degrees body Fahrenheit. Is still so hot. Yeah, I'm just like overheated. We just if we could find an air conditioning room, that would change our lives. <sighs> We cannot find our eating place, but that is perfectly fine because this city is so cool. Everyone's out. It's kind of reminding me of like Vietnam, where it's like everyone's got a little spot on the street. They're selling vegetables and shoe shinings We've and clothes. We've literally been out for like maybe five minutes. And it was all like, we're seeing. Wow. This is so cool. So refreshed. So much better. That was amazing. We are now looking for some gelato because apparently it's super cheap here. We love places that are cheap. Gelato is so good. And apparently there's a market right next to our hotel. So that's what we're gonna go check out next. Definitely hitting up that market tomorrow. I think Leah's gonna make us some cheese dish. Well, I just what? brought the, okay. Please, this is the first time I've please heard make it. us some cheese dish. <laughs> Anyways, and I just smell basil for the first time since we went on our vacation. It's and awesome. I just feel like so unacclimated to everything I'm familiar with because we've been gone for so long now. Yeah, I mean, five months, that's a long time. Okay, so I fell up the stairs. Leah just hit one of these black things. As you can see, they're in a straight line. I don't even know how that's possible. I hit the first one. Just like oh. ran right into it, and this group of tourists were like, "Oh no, is she okay?" And <laughs> I'm too tired. I, to yeah, even, like, I think we're just tired. <laughs> just like the 10-hour bus ride really did us in. It is 
7.10 at night, but we woke up at 4, well, 3.30 this morning. So we were gonna call it a day. Oh, it was, was it 3.30? It was 2.30. We're gonna call it a day and just go to sleep now. Yes. Um, today's been amazing. But this city looks awesome. We are so excited to explore tomorrow. Looks like it has a lot to offer. Yeah, apparently there's free Wi-Fi all across the city, so we can just like work from anywhere. It's crazy. Filming stuff. And I look up and this guy is like right above me smoking a cigarette and I was like, oh my god, like who's what it's like so early in the morning right now.